Lodgett, the author of Iron Roads of the Monadnock Region, the new book which is being sponsored by the Historical Society of Cheshire County. Uh, I've written this book over the last seven years along with my co-author Richard R. Richards. My name is Dick Richards and I'm the co-author with Brad Blodgett on the uh, Iron Roads of the Monadnock Region. There's a lot of interest in railroad history and you can see it in the various books that have appeared and all of the magazines and railroads that, that come out. There's a tremendous interest in all different facets of, of railroading. And the Monadnock region <clears throat> specifically has really been relatively little covered in books. We feel that this book will, uh, will appeal to a wide range of individuals. Certainly the first, and probably the largest group would be railroad enthusiasts who are you know, interested in you know, railroads, their development and so forth. Many railroad enthusiasts, I mean, are very, very particular about you know, detail, historical accuracy, so that we feel this book will really appeal to them. But also some of the people that are just you know, casual railroad enthusiasts, uh, model railroaders. But we also think that it will appeal to just the, uh, the public in general who are interested in the local history. It's important, I, I felt, to document a lot of the history of the railroads of, of the Monadnock region so that uh, someday we'll have this history preserved in writing with pictures uh, and uh, that will be a, a permanent record. So as a result, we went out to make this a book that's not just a picture book but also a, a fairly, fairly detailed histor historical treatment of uh, the railroads in, in Cheshire County their background, why they're here, why they were built in the first place, what they did, what happened to them, and why. The book has pictures of operations of the, of the railroad. We've got tables, we've got maps of where the railroads went. We've got pictures of locomotives of different types. We've got uh, the histories of the different railroads, as I mentioned, the 11 predecessor railroads and, and what happened to them. Any, any rail fan that's curious about that kind of thing, well really this will be uh, an essential uh, book to have on their, their shelf. Uh, I mean, th this is such a rich region in history, you know, especially railroad history, and basically th th this area is what it is today because of the railroads. So I think people that's interested in local history will also find this book very appealing as well.